This is Tech Support from BasicComputerHelp.com. In this video, we're going to learn how to change the artwork on the songs and video oh, on our iPod or any other media device. First, let's get a song. So go to File, Add File to Library, and then I already have an I, my song I want to get from my iPod. Okay, and it was just added as you could plainly see um... it's somewhere in here but anyways I'm not sure where it is oh there it is magic okay now if you want to change it first you're going to need an image um, itunes you can you can right click the song and itunes might be able to get an album artwork by clicking in that and it might get an album artwork um, but if they can't the best way to do it is go online go to google um, type in and search a picture so we'll go to, I have already a good image um, the best size is this 300 by 300 uh, it's 320 by 320 400 by 400 also works but it's better to use 320 by 320 or 300 by 300. So right click, we'll do save image as. We'll save it to the desktop. We'll call it that. Okay. There it's saved. Now what you go to do is do go I go back to iTunes, select the song, go to get info. Now if you've noticed the name is Magic, so and an artist, Lena Gomez. Album, I do not like like how that is, so I'm going to take it out. Uh, options, you can do volume adjustments. You can put an equalizer on there if you want to. That's with all the bars going up and down. Um, media kind, start, or stop time. Uh, remember playback position, I'm going to check that. Because, say, if you do not... I'd like if you say if you like stop in the middle of a song and you start listening to another song, but you want to come back to this song, you it'll go back where you, where you were on that song. You can uh, copy and paste the lyrics on here by just clicking you know paste and then artwork. And this is where this is the picture that you see on your iPod. So we'll do add and then we'll do the image, this one, and then click open. Uh, you can even add another image if you want to. Wanted to. Let's be funny here and put that. See, um, has two images, but and these two images will probably come side by side each other, or they will altern alternate. But if, say if you don't like having this dual image thing, you click on the image, it'll have a blue outline. Then you click delete. Okay, so now we have one image for the artwork, and we've kind of changed change some things. We change, we took out what the album was. Um we'll put there we go. Okay. So now if say you want to check that it it worked, go right click, get info. See, there's a picture. Pretty cool, huh? And then that is how how you change the artwork for a music file. Now if you want to change that for a movie file, you, you simply right click um, get info. Same thing, you can change the info if you wanted to. And then go to uh, artwork, and click add. Um, if you have, don't like the one there is right now, click that. Click the image, click delete, and then add another image. Um, and that, and click OK to save all, all the changes. And that is how you change the artwork on the movie or music file. You can also change it for books if you wanted to. Same in process. And this is basic computerhelp.com. Tech support signing off.